Toys to Life. It's a video game genre where you put toys on some sort of like little pedestal thing and they just poof into the game. I'm talking about it. I'm talking about the Amiibos, Disney Infinity, Skylanders, because I'm on Moving Out Level Dimensions. I'll talk about that one in a different video. So, <clears throat> here I've got all my Skylanders, Disney Infinity, and, oh god, ow, and Amiibo. If I were to sell all these on Amazon or like eBay or something, then I'd have quite the fortune on my hand. Um, I mean, I do got some pretty rare guys. I mean, someone here I got, I mean, I, I got... I, I got quite the rare people. I got I got a few rare people. The rare people. I also have a cuff a couple of customized ones. So I'll show you one of the guys that has been in a few videos. He's been in a few videos. I've got I've got like quite a few rare guys in this pile. And these are two Skylanders examples. Okay, so first we're getting the big one out of the way. Skylanders. Okay, start off with Spiral's Adventure, I guess. Here we have the. Actually, no, I think I'm gonna go in chronological order. The order I got the games. So yeah, let me just grab this portal of power. Please it right there, because now we're gonna. Boom in some Skylanders. Okay, so the first one that I have to talk about has to be Tree Rex. Because he's my favorite character to because he's one of my favorite characters to play as in the game. Now I got the Skylanders Giant Starter Pack. Which came with Tree Rex the game. Yeah, we came with Tree Rex, the game, the portal. A few other people. Okay, I'll just Okay, now the Skylanders starter pack also came with this, this guy. Don't remember his name. I, I got like two versions of that guy. And somebody else. Uh, I just, if I can find that person. You see, th this is why this isn't very helpful to Batman. Batman. You see, this is why it's not really helpful to have it like this. To have your stuff like this. My goodness, it's so hard to find everything. Yeah, I'll just go for this person first. Then. Now, this is another Skylander I got when I first started off playing Sonic Boom, predicting one of the worst games ever. Anyways, I didn't get this person in the starter pack. I I got the game for Christmas. I immediately opened up the starter pack. I lost the poster. When we're like swap for some trap team. Super Chargers. Anyways, yes, I used to be a huge Skylander geek. I'm thinking about starting up a Let's Play for Skylanders if I want to. You guys tell me if that'd be interesting. Anyways, here is one of my favorite guys, Pop Face. I lost a little bottle he comes with. I, I just really like the overall design and how he plays in the game. Yeah, he's a magic guy. Uh, He's one of the first magic element guys I got. The very first one I got has to be Wrecking Ball. I got Wrecking Ball for Christmas one year. I'm, I'm like, oh man, this guy must be really weird because I saw this guy on eBay. Yeah, it's my, he's my stepsister's favorite. He's not really that good in the game to me. Yeah. Now then, I'm going to go on to one guy I was super hyped for when I got him. Bright Rider. Right Rider is just a super awesome guy. Just, I like the overall design for him and the way he plays in the game. Now this is a guy when I first saw him, I, I was like, oh man, rockets on his fists? Because those aren't rockets. Anyways, I saw this guy in the store. I decided not to pick him up, so I didn't pick him up. But I got him later on in a three pack. Along with some other people. Now, instead, that day I got a few other people, but. I can... If this is one of the people who I got instead that day, my very first Light Core figure, also, I think my only Light Core figure, Light Core Eruptor. Yeah. yeah, back then I was really just determined. I was like, oh man, it would be like that YouTube channel I watch. 
scale and boy and girl, I'm gonna collect all of them, yeah! Spoiler alert. Surprise, surprise, this isn't all of them. There's a whole bunch more. I actually, I actually shoved a, like a ton on that shelf over there at one point. I was like, happy birthday, me! Anyways, I got, I got this guy for Easter once. And I played him a lot. I actually painted him to look like, like some sort of boxer, yeah! Like a mask, like that. Like, like that. I, I wanted to get rid of the chains. Like, like those are his boxing gloves, yeah! Like, those are his shoes, a boxing ring, this white. It's very bad design. I wasn't that good of an artist back then. I was not the best at it. But, I'm better. Here's another person I designed. To look like Bert Simpson. I think it looks pretty good. I mean, I mean Bert Simpson, like, it, it was mostly yellow with a picture of black right there. I feel like a little something. With a picture of red and blue. I mean, now, now looking back, it just looks awful. Oh, yeah. So then, next we have a hot dog. I really wanted this guy. I asked my dad to pick him up, and he and he mixed up with an actual hot dog. Get out of here, Bird Simpson. No one likes you. Okay, next up we got Trigger Happy. I actually got three different Trigger Happies. They all aren't the same level. This guy, I picked him up in a three-pack with a few other people. At one point, when I went to, to a Toys R Us, I think I got him in a three-pack. So. I know I, I got this guy like at one point I just walked into page three I'm like oh look would you look at that guy I love Skylander who should buy him I did and he had a hat on him in the game like a virtual hat like a cowboy hat yeehaw I mean he was pre-owned down there at page three yeah so um dino ring I guess I can't like dino ring I don't know it just has like the best design like my mom had started stocking up the Spyro's Adventure characters again. That, that's how I got into collecting the Spyro's Adventures. So we got Spyro's Adventure. I got both of these guys at the same point in time. Warnado. And we got the electric guy. I really like this guy. He, I like his super cool, like, like how, how he looks, but Warnado, he just reminds me of like a snappy turtle I found out at one point that, that bit me. That was not a fun time. Anyways, so, I would say let's move on to Swap Force, but there's a ton of giants, giant characters. G giants, okay. Here we have this guy. My mom surprised him with me at once for Halloween. Pumpkin Eyeball. I never got the, the actual eyeball. I just, I just left them in some random bin at Toys R Us. I'm like, oh look, it's Eyeball. Anyways, the Thumb Smash guy, I got him in a pack with this person and a normal Sonic Boom that I gave to my cousin. Because we are not halfway done with all the Skylanders. Anyways, I guess now we'll go on to Swap Force. Oh yeah, we still got some Giants characters. We got Bouncer. I haven't talked about too many giants. I, like, I, at one point, I'm, I'm like, okay, I'm not collecting all the Skylanders. I'm collecting all the giants. Yeah. I, I did not collect all the giants. Okay, so, um, I, I got, uh, oh, yeah, this person also came in the stone pack. You can find them. There you go. Aeris, I'll call them. Okay, I got this one person pre-owned at GameStop. I really like them in the game, they were really fun to play with. Into the pile they go. Alright then, so um next is Shared Go. I'm gonna go fast for them. I wanna get done with the Skylander pack quickly. I want to paint this guy to look like a lucky guy character. Gil Bill. I'm gonna call him Gil Bill. Yes. Um, I'm okay. So next. 